hello guys welcome back to my channel more tech videos and today we will see how we can import export group policies and also we will see how we can copy and paste the existing policies so let's go ahead and start so this is my domain dot com and uh, I am in group policy management so let me show you how many policies I have how this much policy I have which I already created so if I have a requirement to deploy the same policy which I already have and uh, sometimes guys it is very uh, time consuming job if we have already one policy with so many content and we have to look for all the content and come across and apply in the new policy so to achieve this we have option copy and paste so let me show you how we can do that and suppose i need one policy here in the chn OU. there is no policy linked so far uh, to this OU so let me pick any policy like this one so what i will do actually you have to go to group policy uh, objects and you cannot achieve it uh, from the ou itself you have to always go to group policy objects so even here all policies uh, group policies will, uh, will list list out so let's consider this is the policy and uh, I want to apply the same policy to uh, CHNOU. So what I will do right click on that and do copy again I have to go to group policy object and right click and paste. Okay use the default permission so whatever permissions are there on that code policy those will be applied say okay and this is succeeded say ok and you have for now and the policy but it is you can see not linked to anywhere but if you see the content we have the same content available here and we have in this policy okay let's go ahead and apply this policy so i will go to the container ou and link an existing policy i will select the policy which is pasted one copy of ms store block so i will click on that yes now if i want to rename it i can go ahead and rename it so you can rename it anytime there is uh, no difference it will not impact to any machine or the user so you can uh, do it by any time so i'll do it like new policy for chn okay so this is all done my policy is done and this is new policy you can see the same content which I have in the MS store and block so this is how we can do the copy and paste and let's move on to export or import so guys we need it basically when you want to create a standard policy and that is applicable to all users or computers so that is the default policy and later on you can make changes as per your requirement in the policy so let's go ahead and do it so suppose uh, this is my new policy and uh, let's export this and this way we can do the backup of a single policy so this is kind of back backup only so select backup and give it a location uh, let me go to C drive tam and here std standard policy 
okay and we can give the description uh, i would give both as a standard policy let's back up okay so this is done so you can see this is succeeded let's click okay so let me create a new ou i go ahead and create a new ou del click okay and i put import that to this one so what i will do i will have to create a dummy policy for this first so let me go ahead and create a policy that is standard policy and as you can see there is no computer setting there is no user setting applied this on, on this policy so what i will do i will go again to group policy object and uh, go to your policy so this is my policy which is i recently created for uh, dial ou so right click on that import settings and the next the next you can do the backup as well whatever settings are ap applied currently on this so you can do the backup and go ahead with import so this is my path and say next yes you can see the name so this is my policy you can view the settings so if you open it in html it would be good but here i opened in notepad so it will not, not visible that much so let's select next and finish okay it is succeeded let's click on ok and now you see the contents are there so guys in day to day operations uh, uh, these things uh, helps a lot like copy and pasting because it's a kind of very uh, hectic job uh, to find out each and uh, every content and do the policy if we have very less content then yes uh, we can do it but to think uh, if we have a lot of settings in a single policy then sometimes it becomes very hectic task so this way we can do it and for the export import you can define a standard policy and uh, you can apply in your uh, infra to all users computers so you can have one policy and with this you can import the settings so guys uh, hope you um, uh, enjoyed this video and uh, thanks for watching